Guys, welcome to East Lake Golf Club, home of the Tour Championship of the FedEx Cup Finale, the last event in the FedEx Cup Playoffs. It is crazy, in a few weeks' time, these grandstands will be just packed full of people. It has not been the start we were looking for. He says, yo, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> yes! Snuck in! A very special match today at a tour course featuring... None other than Michael Morris, he's back. We're back with the match on a PJ tour course. Are you kidding me? If you haven't watched the first video, the front nine is on uh, Micah's channel, so be sure to go watch it. It'll be in the description. But let's, hey, let's have a good back nine. Let's have fun. Let's go. Look at the grandstands up. My gosh. First up, hole 10, par 4, 4 10. Hey, right on par. Just right, hey, right on brand with how the front nine went. Sure. Be nice, just inside the also, and as a spoiler alert, um, I think I hit two fairways on the front nine, maybe one. So it's been a grind and working man's, I did shoot two over, played solid, given the fact that I didn't hit any fairways, but it's gonna be a lot of fun. I'm telling you guys, one of the most pure courses I've played, one of the hardest courses I've played, so I'm excited for you guys to watch a battle between me and Micah. Go down four for $18 million. That's what the winner gets here. So why not play for that? <laughs> Woo. Let me check this out. Sick, uh, sick on the green. I think what I'm gonna do, Call me crazy, we're gonna try to hit this low hook and somehow get it over there around the green, which that's, that's where the pin is. Uh, I'm just gonna try it. Oh my. Drew, what did I do? On top of the bunker. You're okay. Wait, it's not a green? This went a little long, rough, right rough on top of the bunker. <laughs> hey. Oh my! How about this start, huh? This one. Thank you. A little better than my, a little, a little better than my last start, I tell you. All right, so we've played nine holes here. We've played a lot of really good golf courses. How would you rate, or how like toughness, funness, like? What, give us your thoughts on the first nine here. The front nine was amazing. As far as like the level of toughness of the course, when you miss the fairways, I'm, I'm saying 10 out of 10. It's the hardest course I've ever played. The rough, I literally feel like I'm gonna need to ice my wrist after this because I've hit so many times, so many punch shots, hit so many like wedges where you're just absolutely yakking down on it. But the course itself, if I can start getting them in the fairways, I think that I can actually do some damage, but it's in perfect conditions. Mm -hmm. I might have a tap in, a little bit long. That's where it landed. It had to scare that great shot. I'm just, it landed over that bunker, which, I mean, heck, I'll take that. Scoot it over the green, but hey, given where I drove it, we got a chance. Oh no, it felt fluffy. Get over oh, the hill, get over oh, the hill. No. Oh no, Micah. Oh, real fluffy. You need to carry, what, about 10 more feet? Yeah, not 10 more feet. That's just the tough thing in this Bermuda. watch the front now and you will know that did not happen. Double bogey. Mm. Mm. <laughs> hey, two over after one. Let's go. That is clutch, Micah. I don't even need the putter. Do I even need the putter? I don't need the putter. I don't need the putter. We were looking at potential disaster off this start. Look at this. We avoided it. Oh boy, we did we avoid it. Here we go, Micah. Good, better, way better distance, but still a tough little shot. 
Apparently this is landing into essentially an upslope. That's what my caddy told me, so I'm going right. to trust him. I'm going to carry this about four feet on, five feet on. Try to. All right. And make it. Oh, gosh. Mm -hmm. I might should have putted that to be honest. I don't know if I'm I don't know if I'm like where I need to be to be trying to hit that shot. This is the longest. Oh, what a putt. Just slide. That's good. Man, Heck of a putt. A little unfortunate, but even par through two. Even holes. par, two or for me. I got a much needed stroke back. I know it's only the second hole of yeah, our you, match. You, that could have been a potential disaster for you there, but that's a great up and down. Thanks. Well, team, it has not been the start we were looking for. Three holes, three absolutely dead right shots. But we're going to try to find the positives, and we made a great par on the second hole. <sighs> More, we just got to apologize to Katie. You've had to watch these two shots, these three holes. I'm sorry. Anyway, what we're going to hold on to is everyone's going to keep being positive. We're not going to be just because I hit them dead right. They're like, oh, my God, day's ruined. No, we're going to problem solve. Like, okay, why do I hit it right? I get out in front of it. My body gets just really quick. So we're trying, going to try to smooth some things out, be a little more smooth, uh, get those arms down a little bit before the body goes, and just see if we can finish this thing strong. Guys, this might be my best shot of the green I've had all day. <laughs> we're in the rough, yes. But we have a shot at the green that's un unrestricted, uninhibited by trees. There we go. Mike, I got a little 60 yarder, hand over the pin. Really good. Thanks. Really good. Nice. Good three. We're good for par. Good four. All right. So we're heading to. Pars feel like threes today. Hey, that bumps lead back up to three, four, five. What? What? Something even like even that. par still. What'd you, what'd you make? I made bogey. So I'm three over. Okay. Three so we're heading to the twelfth. Yeah. Thirteenth hole. Yeah. Our fourth of this match. Even three over for me. Again, just if you get out position out position out here. That's the absolute not, worst. Yeah, you're not. You get you get absolutely just there is no forgiveness whatsoever. None. Zero. I guess that's what a PGA Tour course is supposed to be like. Yeah, I agree. All right, guys, here we go. Fairway found. Let's go. 125, right pin, green light special. Also, a little tip for you guys. I aimed mine about 25, 30 feet left there to play a fade because the pin was right. I have been missing a whole lot of iron shots, a whole lot of drives. And so instead of trying to get aggressive and like, okay, I got a birdie chance, let's, let's fire right at it. And I was like, you know what? We're going to play conservative and take 20, 25 feet just to get on the green to give myself a look at birdie. And that's what we did. Now, Micah, Man. another great lie. Distance doesn't do any, anything for you when you hit it in the rough here. We got um, I got 70 yards. I got 80, 75 yards to the pan. I'm gonna hit about a just a little runner with an eight iron. Mm -hmm. Oh my! What a shot! You okay. kidding me, Micah? Stop it! I'm trying to get like a stroke back here, and you're over here hitting punch chip eight irons under trees, right at it. <laughs> Holy cow! I mean, that the guy's got great. better. I mean, maybe maybe the play 80 yards in the bunkers or in the rough. Little chip eight irons. Yeah. yeah. Is it less expectation, Joe George? 
Wow, what a shot. I mean, heck, I'm, I'm pleased with mine. Hit too hard. Nice, good birdie. The difference between the front nine and the back nine. The back nine, I don't know. It's 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 so polar opposite. It's absolutely incredible. It is so polar opposite. It's unreal. But you hey, know, it, hey, it feels good. Nice. It feels good. It yeah. feels good. I'm just gonna go grind over my five footers for par. Nice. Hey, small victories. We did make a par. Holding strong at three over. Plus five to on the overall tally. Yeah. This is two separate match videos, but we're our, we're competitive by nature. He's he's four over on the day, and I'm five over. Wow, we got us a good match. All right, see you on the uh, 14th tee. All right, here we go, guys. A 540 yard par four. Um, so we can't play the tournament tees right there, so we're playing it the true par this uh, today. It's the longest par four I've ever oh played. Oh my god, 540 uh, down this walkway. No, that's okay? looks easy. Great ball. Heel cut. Yeah, that's so good. It has to be good. It has to be. All right, you want to know why this course is so hard? We have a 540 yard par four. Let me walk off the fairway width for you guys. Hold on. One, two, three. 17 yards wide, 540. And if you hit the fair, if you miss the fairway, you're like chipping out. You would think you would think the longest hole out here maybe give us 25 yards, you know? Or hey, how about 30? You know, what about 30, Micah? No, 17. It's absolutely wild, and it's into the wind. And Micah's right down the center. I mean, that's nothing here nor there. And but I hit a great one. And this is what you're going to see why championship golf is championship golf. Because if you're a little bit off, you can be a lot off in the score department. How are we feeling? All right, I got 220 the flag. That's about the number I'm going to play. It's a little downhill, but it's a little into the wind, so I think it cancels out. George hit a great shot to about pin high. So I'm just going to... I'm just gonna hit a four iron. Try to try to hold just something right there, mm -hmm. left of the pin. Yeesh. I'm finally about to feel like what it feels like to be me. Does that make sense? Feel like what it feels like to be me? I just wish I would have started that left of the pin, <laughs> and it was perfect. It is crazy. In a few weeks' time, these grandstands will be just packed full of people watching. A, like on this golf course, we're playing uh, Tour Championship playoff. FedEx Cup playoffs, grand finale here at East Lake Golf Club. Pretty cool. Now he's faced with quite a difficult shot. But way, hey, way better than what we thought, like up there. But yeah, still. or even just being in this stuff. Yeah. Honestly, I'm super happy he got to the bunker. It's really good. Yeah, I don't know how much more I could have done. Sometimes you have to take your medicine, and that's exactly what Micah did there. Um, Heck of a shot, like knowing the situation, not trying to get too cute. Yeah. Um, still gives himself a chance to par. Yeah. Hey, nice work. Those are the underrated decisions that like really keep rounds going. Yeah, exactly. Everyone say hi to Drew. Hi, Drew. Uh, we need his best read today. This is a big time. I'm four down, I believe, to Mike. He's one under. I'm three over. That's uh, 2% across the, across the slope, left to right. I think it may actually behave like a, just a tick up the hill, uh -huh. just a tick. And if it's me and I've got 18 million, which is first prize money <laughs> in the playoff finale, I'm playing about 20 inches of break left, right. Got it. A phenomenal four. That's like a birdie. Guys, that's like a birdie. 540, par four. Come on, that's a birdie. Oh, mm. it's good strokes, a little more gas. All in all, again, not a bad five though. As G3 used to say, when you're out of position, you just gotta get back in position. Sometimes it's annoying, you don't wanna make those fl unflashy bogeys, but like, welcome to hole 15, everyone. Let me look at this beautiful water. 115 yards for us today, but the tournament tees that we don't have access, unfortunately, wink wink, is back there playing, I don't know, 180, 190, 200, which can you imagine a shot like that? into that green. Shoot. 115. 115 looks like it's a little down breeze. I think I'm gonna hit just a nice, really smooth little sandwich. I like it. I yeah, like I, it. I think that's gonna be really good. Same for me. Oh, 
Oh, please. I need it. I need it, Micah. Oh. Really good. Oh. Wind didn't help it climb. <laughs> Golly, I've been swimming with the fishies. Oh, no. It's got to come. Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? I mean, of course, I'm pulling for you, yes. I, I really am. That was not who I am. I'm not that. I'm not going to pull against you, I promise. He says, yo, you got to be kidding me. <laughs> hey, you got, you got life. That was hey, you got just absolutely it. just <laughs> mental. This is what I was, uh, whatever, whatever words I said um, of encouragement of Micah, but barely stays up. Again, he's fine because he's got tons green to work with. There's mine up the hill. Good looking birdie, so back to back holes for me. Um, but we got Mike has got life. Really good, Micah. Really heck of a par. I'm gonna give that to him. Just enough. Just a slight pull. Great ball there, Birdie. We also got to show love uh, to the spouses. Thank you. Katie Thank Morris, you. out here filming. Like, it's been cool. Yeah. We also the same thing, seeing you grind and Thanks. help out. Thank so, you. So, uh, much appreciated. Any, uh, Thank you. Anything you want to say? Well, I get to have a lot of amazing experiences, so I'm really thankful to be out here with George and Tig. And, uh, yeah, hopefully I'm getting some good phone content for George, too. Oh, wow. I didn't know she was getting stuff for me, too. Let's go. But, no, for real, Mills, uh, you, you guys see the, the stuff that goes on YouTube, but usually, there's someone filming, and uh, it's me for the most part today, but she's been filming all of Micah's stuff, and a lot of stuff you see on his channel, she does as well. So, without them, we couldn't be out here doing this, so yeah, gotta show them some love. And it's like 100 degrees. It's like so hot. We don't have a cart, we're walking. Three down, three to go. I need to come back. A little left for Micah, but he, he's gonna have life. There's a gap there, or you can play conservative low hook. Right over Caddy's head, right there. Yeah, that's exactly what you gotta do. Good shot. Maybe a little short and a little left is the right, ideal yeah. placement. So we're gonna play a one. So would you say 115 shot? Just like yeah. The sandwich is probably gonna get me short, but that's exactly 20, where you oh want to yeah. be. I mean, I think we did what I was kind of trying to do. Exactly what we wanted to do. Big spot for Micah here. Up and down for par. Oh, he's going the runner approach. One hop. Come on. Oh, it's just... See, that's how far he's going to have. Right idea, just a little easy. Think two over for me, even for Tig. This round, like, as bad as we've had starts, we're fighting hard. Yeah, no kidding. Are hey, you good? I, I feel like I'm 100 over par right now. How mentally, I'm mentally exhausted trying to, like, just grind every hole. Yeah. Oh, like, let's go. be strong. Let's make some birdies. Oh, I found it. There we go. Rejected. <laughs> it's fine. So this is what we're working with. Hole number 17, dog leg to the left. Just got to care of those bunkers. Just smoke it, trust it. It's a good hole today. All right. Saddle up. Just hang back. Just hang back. Hold on. Seriously. You know, the driver swing, really, really the driver swing had been there today. We've been fighting it all day and it's been exaggerated or amplified by the fact that these trees around the fairways are placed perfectly. Like this one probably gonna be blocked out again. I have to chip out much like I've done all throughout the day. So it's like, you know, we preach a lot. Hey, how good are your misses? Well, today they're getting me in a world of trouble. I'm four over par. We're hanging in there, but just 
you know, time after time, we can't ever get, you know, anything going. Like, I've had two good looks from the fairway in a row, and then bam, you probably have to ship out again. But again, these days are fun to fight, and when you don't have your best stuff, to see how good you really are. So, we're gonna, uh, we're gonna take the positives. Not a great lie, 85, 95 yards, um, but we have a shot. So balls come out dead out of a thick lie like that, but you can't go long and you're kind of used, hey, a full lob wedge is gonna go for me 100 yards. Well, when you only have a 75 yard shot, telling yourself to, to, to swing full, mentally it's tough to do that. And didn't do a great job, but still hit a clean flush shot the way I wanted to, just didn't quite swing hard enough. We gotta look at, a lot of look at birdie, very long one. Oh boy, Micah has some trouble, has his work cut out. Oh my gosh. That people don't understand how good of a shot that was. I know he's not on the green, but the fact that he judged it perfectly, and if it kicks a little right, oh my God. heck of a shot. It ain't gonna show up on the stat sheet, but he's got that for birdie. Pretty good speed there. Great weight. Thanks. Here we go. Hole 18. There, there it is. Hit it at the, at the grandstands. Let it feed to the left. Here we go. I think that's exactly what they told you to do, Jordan. That's just as good as they say it is. Thanks. Also, hole 18, you guys might remember, this is where Tiger won in 2018, and the, the crowd just took over the golf course, and it was one of the coolest things. I get goosebumps thinking about seeing Tiger come through the crowd and winning here at East Lake Golf Club. Absolutely crazy that we're, that we're, we're playing it with the grandstands up. I'm getting goosebumps thinking about this. <sighs> this is awesome. Here we go, folks. 235 downhill, playing about 220, 225. There it is. Let's go. Micah gave you a big old opening. Where we at? Wait, oh. I'm, not, I'm about to see what I think I'm about to see. Oh, am I ever. 220. The gap of the century. No, again, I love this. 220, 224. Yeah. 229 to the pin. I'm trying to hit front yardage at 215. So I got five iron in hand. Okay. Time to make a big play. Where'd you go? Oh, uh, left the green. Okay. Kind of grand, just think grand stance. I think grand. That far. All right, show me something. Oh, he just closed the door. Yep, he closed it right on me. It's gonna hurt. Just right, sh shove it, shove it. Slam it right in my face. Just slam it right in my face, Micah. That's crazy. Slammed it in my face, took my heart out, threw out the window. Wow. All the above. Did it, did it look just a smidge short, right? Oh yeah, 12 feet for eagle. That's fun, that is fun. You know, sometimes it pays to be lucky, lucky in this game. That's what, that's what happened, you saw it with Micah. Terrible drive, perfect lie, I mean, couldn't ask for a better lie, and then he does that. I'm actually glad it, I, I'm it kidding. The Sarcasm there. Now, yes, he got lucky, but he, the shot that he pulled off there was sick. Perfect contact with, I don't know, five iron. To, I mean, he had two stroke lead. Basically, if he just has a pulse, he's gonna win, but he pulled off a sick shot. But we still got a chance of making birdie here. We're not giving up, no sir. So you guys, this is what I'm talking about. Big time players make big time plays. I wish I could have seen up, that from up here. Locks down the win. After the battles we've had, it's good to see the big guy pull it off. Hey, it's not done. I can chip my. It's, you can chip it stop. in. I'm yeah. <laughs> All right, George has a good lie. He's got an opportunity here. Don't, don't count out the chip in. I ain't. Good shot from there. All right, pushed it a hair. A heck of a birdie under par on the back nine. Come on. I'll take a birdie on 18. I'll take a birdie on 18. What a what a good round of golf. Yes, but I'm, I gotta make mine. I've already lost. It's fine. You but make it for the morale. Wait, what are you overall? Oh, if I make this, I win the overall. I'm four over overall. What are you right four now? Over. Uh -oh. If you make this, you win overall.
Good job. Good job. Yes. Fought back. Now. Way to come back. Way to, way to, way to fight through a round. That's of golf big. Right I mean, it really like. Yes, I won the overall, but that's not the the point. The the match structure today was front and back. So you won one, I won one. But the fact that I shot three over today and he shot four, and Micah shot four over I after like our I starts. Shot it felt like I shot eighty. That's big. We got to give a shout out to these guys. Yeah, Drew. Awesome. Amazing time. Thank you so much. That was awesome. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Hey, Drew. Enjoyed it, pro. Thanks so much for your help. Yeah, PJ Tour, thank you so much for having us out here, letting us play on a PJ Tour championship golf course, the FedEx Cup finale. Awesome. Right here, the tour championship right here. We got to play it. Um, didn't, hey, we didn't embarrass ourselves. We played well, we played solid. Me and Mike were both talking about, it. we want to crack at this again. <sighs> we want to crack at it. Hey, maybe the tour championship, you never know. Anyway, thank you for watching this video. Be sure to watch the tournament this week. Final tournament in the FedEx Cup playoffs, the tour championship from East Lake Golf Club. Hey, course, if you ever get a chance to play here, you got to. 10. Hey, 10, 10 out of 10, 10, but bring an extra dozen of balls. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we'll see you next time, wherever that is.